Yeah, so I get super, super nervous, but if you keep practicing and you memorize it so that you know it like the back of your hand, it'll just flow out of you. And don't be afraid to have note cards up with you or an outline if your teacher allows it, because that will help guide you and really um, structure your whole speech. For me, what I find was I did, from, I got to know my, my classmates better. Um, and if you know your classmates better, um, you're able to just speak to them. That's like you're speaking to your friend. Once you got to know your, um, your peers well enough, um, you became familiar with your classmates and by the second speech, I was like, all right, this is good. I'm used to it now. Just take a deep breath and breathe. Act like you're talking to your mom. Take a deep breath and understand that everyone's in the same point of view. You know, when you're up there, you gotta take a deep breath, calm yourself down. For my sp first speech, I did get very flustered and I paused for a good minute maybe. So just take a deep breath, you know, shake it out a little bit, come back together and go with the flow. Just take deep breaths in your nose, out your mouth, um, spread your legs open when you stand, like have a nice spread so then you could have a full deeper breath. But other than that, you're going to be great. Everybody else is doing it. Nobody's going to make fun of you and it'll be over before you know it. For me, something that really worked, when you're up there, like, it's just, like, scary seeing, like, all your classmates just, like, look at you. But besides that, you have to, like, take a lot of deep breaths and definitely practice. You just practicing by, like, a group of your friends just, like, helps you a lot. I get really nervous when talking in front of people. I mean, I feel like I'm okay when I'm sitting back, like, in my seat and talking. Um, but basically, try to talk in front of, like, a group of people so, you know, you're, you'll be okay. Um, when talking in front of a large group. You know, what I did was actually, I had a friend or a family member that I actually stood in front of, that stood in front of me as I gave my speech over and over again. And that helped me prepare for my speech. And while I, when I gave, when I, the day I actually had to give my speech, I was more confident in giving my speech because I already had practiced the speech. Um, I think everybody does get nervous. So if you have a friend or a confidant, uh, that you can find in your classroom that's helpful because you can, although you can look around a room briefly and not really make eye contact, you can make the eye contact with that person um, who will give you that reassuring nod or smile that sometimes is needed. Understand that everybody's as nervous as you are. It's, it's just the truth. Everybody hates giving speeches. There, there are very few, if any, people that, that are born with, with the, the love of everybody watching them. It's, it's something that everybody goes through. So, no, you're not alone. Don't be afraid. Um, enjoy it. Enjoy the nervousness. Um, I once heard uh, Patti LaBelle, uh, they asked her, someone, um, a reporter asked her, do you ever stop getting nervous? And she said, never. Once you stop getting nervous, uh, you lose your edge. So embrace the nervousness, go with it, and um, greater things are in store afterwards. <laughs>